All right, guys, and we're here at Yeti Gaming. Look at all the cool Pokemon stuff they have in the window. And they also have all types of stuff uh, Pokemon related behind the counter. They actually, Yeti Gaming got started in Pokemon when they initially started the shop. In a minute, we're gonna learn more about that from Andrew, who is the son of the owner here at Yeti Gaming. You can see their big Sunday tournament they have. It starts at 1 p.m. every Sunday. So that is pretty cool. All right, guys, and we're here today with Andrew, who is the owner and manager here at Yeti Gaming, and he's gonna tell us a little bit more about what they have going on and why they got started in the Pokemon community. Yeah, so the reason we actually got started was uh, at the beginning, uh, when we were entering high school, me and my brothers, uh, my dad just wanted us a place to work, and we've been doing Pokemon for as long as I can remember. I think me and my brothers have been like about 20 years now. Carrying all that experience that we've had over the, the years, just, you know, wanted to keep growing the community around St. Louis. And uh, what type of events do you guys have here for people who are interested in playing? So yeah, so every week we do Pokemon events, we do Magic events, we do Yu-Gi-Oh events. We've got Magic pre-releases coming up this weekend. Um, Unified Minds is coming out around, I think pre-releases in August. And other than that, just a lot of weekly events. All right, guys, and we're here with Vince, the owner of Yeti Gaming, and he's going to tell us a little bit more about the young man who won the Yu-Gi-Oh tournament recently and what his family got. Yes, Lucas Oswald started playing Yu-Gi-Oh at Yeti, and he was in a tournament with over 2,000 competitors a couple weeks ago for the World Championship Qualifier. He finished in first place, winning not only a couple thousand dollars worth of prizes on site, but he and his family get a paid trip to Germany to play in the World Championships. There's only about 12 people all year who play for the Yu-Gi-Oh! World Championships, and Lucas will be representing not only the United States, but, North, but Yeti Gaming as well. All right, everyone, thanks for joining me as we take a look at Yeti Gaming in St. Louis. These guys are truly a legendary force in the Pokemon trading card game world. And a quick update on our boy Lucas Oswald. He was actually able to win in the 2019 Yu-Gi-Oh! Championship in Germany. So big shout out to him and Yeti Gaming. Guys, if you're ever in St. Louis, make sure you go check them out. Thanks for joining us and we'll see you soon.